Hello and welcome to Oxygen Not Included. This is going to be episode number three here on Serene Space Rock. Now, I have noticed a few things. First off is this, anytime you build something, I found out that you can actually choose different elements, which will give it different effects. Like see, if I build these pipes out of sandstone, it's 10% decor. But if I build them out of igneous rock, I get plus 27 degrees overheat temperature and slow heating, which is pretty interesting. I never knew that. I, I just, that that's actually really interesting. I'm going to keep it at sandstone because I have the most of that for now. But that's something that I probably should look into later on. Um, when I get more materials for certain things. The other thing that I probably should have paid attention to more is priorities here. And apparently, you can assign a priority to different dupes so that they do other things more than others. I'm not sure. Everything here has a standard priority of 30. Okay, but I think the purples are what they're best suited for. So, if these are what they're most inclined to do which is tidying i should probably i'm going to put Mimaw. he's good at tidying and supplying who's my digger Lindsay. okay she's really good at building I'm gonna go up now she's got high priority to build high high priority to build no wait let's just do that high priority to build standard priority for digging i think or should I put digging up too? I'm not really sure. I have quite a few people that are good at that. Ashcan is my researcher, so that's going to be his top priority. Is that supplying, storing, tidying? Because I have other people that could do tidying, supplying, and storing too. I think I'll leave them there. Cooking will be his top priority. That way, I always have food being made. I think that should be good, as long as I have somebody cooking, somebody researching, and somebody building. I probably could switch this a little bit around, but these other people can all take care of everything else. They're gonna run around and do whatever they want, too. Also, I should probably finish this in insulated tile. Like so. Oh! There's also, I seen, a natural gas geyser down here. Which is interesting. This would be a supply of natural gas for more power. And I can kind of see what I think is another one of those, like, alien... Alien whatever you call them. This is the thing that was over on this side back in Hovel. But is now here. Oh, and the other problem is, is that I built this laboratory room. But I fricked up. And I built it too small. Because to be a laboratory... Needs to be at least 32 tiles, and this room is only 20 tiles. And then that's where the actual door will go. And fix this, construct that. Like so. Now, as far as, wasn't there a, something I could do for a Great Hall? Great Hall is just a mess hall, but better things. Mess table, decor item, plus 20 decor, recreation building, mess hall. We dig this stuff up, and then build some more mess tables. What else can I do for decor? My something I have unlocked yet there's also another room I seen here which is a greenhouse that would be for plants but I need to have that needs a farm station and then the plants which I can't do because I don't have the room right there yet and then the other one is a power plant which would be interesting okay now this I was going to hook up but I'm thinking maybe I shouldn't do this yet because if I go ahead and hook this up I don't know. Actually, is it cold underneath it? It's cold over here. Oh, I should probably definitely put some insulated tiles here because I think this room will get hot. 
Let's let's do this in insulated tiles. Oops. Insulated tiles too. That way I don't have to worry about residual heat coming off of this. I don't think it's hot over here, but I probably just switch this because this is just sandstone anyway, but if I do this in insulated tiles too. Okay. Now, my problem is, is that if I go ahead and hook this up, I'm going to be consuming water that I know for a fact I won't be able to get backed. And my only problem with that is, like I said, I won't be able to get it back. Let me see if I have a research. Fossil sound. Cables would probably be good. I am going to need to do smelting eventually. I don't think I need that right yet. Let's go to improved ventilation. No, we'll do portable gases and then improved ventilation. Which will allow me to get oxygen masks. But I do want to fix the power problem. But I can run manual generators if I have to on that jumbo battery. And just keep this nice and small for now. Because we've got food. The water, I'm not using any. Right now. It's all just going polluted and then back into here. So what I can do to take their little, take a problem off of them, is do laboratories require uh, just water in and water out? So I can take this out as well. I could switch them over to laboratories, but I think I'm going to wait a minute on that too. I should do a carbon skimmer. There's a carbon dioxide. But that uses water as well, so I need to, I need to get more water. And right now, my way to get water, research, that way. To get more water, I have an option for up here. I want to, like, kind of combine this with that. So, can I just go straight to insulated tile? Yeah. Because these just take 400 sandstone, whereas those take 200. So it's twice as much. Alright, I don't want all my water running into here yet. It would also be kind of nice to find a geyser of some sort. Somewhere. Oh, and I could build them showers, too, eventually. Has this got decor in it? Needs decor. I don't think I have anything else that's... Decor 5. Decor plus 5. What can I plant in hanging pots, though? Would be the question. Let's do a hanging plant and see if I have anything I can put in it. I don't. I remember building one of those. Oh, they're at eating meal lice. That's good. Just blueprint. We have dirt. Hmm. Cannot do digging. But you have good strength. But I need someone who can do digging. Joyous seed. Okay. We'll do that. I'm still not really... I'm not pushing for another dupe. I'm going to take it slow. What is it? Joya? I, I still don't know. Okay, everybody's got time to get food. Pallet build location. It's still in a dig area now. Okay, temperature wise, good. Oxygen wise, good. Let's put, can I add, how did I get algae up there last time? I wanna keep an eye on how much algae I have. And then I'm gonna put up how much meal lice I have too. And how much lice low. Efficient resources mush bar. Isn't there... Well, I thought there was another thing under food that they could make. Aside from that. Oh! I was also thinking I could do a hydroponic farms. Instead... Hmm. I think I'll do a latrine. Like, I'll deconstruct one of these. And then I'll build a latrine here. No, wait. I'll cancel that. Cancel that. There's this little room. And the idea behind this is that... Okay. Hydrogen out up to... And one. Get your ass vents. Like so. There's my jumbo jumbo battery. That'll do a maximum of a thousand watts. That there. Okay, and there's that system that's hooked up. I just need to hook it up to water. 
Which, if it's not hot down here, it's kind of hot down there. You could just pump this water right on out of here. Technically. So if I do that, and then build down like so. Build tiles here, and then dig up this. Hey, Mima, put another liquid pump in down here. That way I can use this water for a while. This ladder up here. Take that. That way they can probably reach that one too. I think they can reach that, but... But they can reach this wall if I decide to put a pipe inlet in, which I'm gonna need to. And then we'll do a plumbing. Right like so. And then that will... Power that. Okay. There we go. 447, 495. I don't understand why I won't have... Because my LG isn't going down right now. 39,000 calories. Why is that going down? Probably would not hurt if I planted more food. Where should I plant it? I should also... I should probably put together a little thing for hatching. So I have more power. And do I have enough to do that? Critter drop off critter feeders do that. Do I have someone that can wrangle? Oh, let's see what I can plant in there. Briar seed. Improves decor. Atmosphere, oxygen, blue oxygen. Oh, that works. Oh, wait, it needs to be in a farm plot. Planter box, farm tile, or hydroponic farm. Okay, but it is just for planting, for decor. So... Planter boxes are negative decor. That's positive decor. But I have wall pots. That says farm plot. Well, that kind of stinks. Why can't I use a flower pot? I don't try building a flower pot. But if I was to build a latrine and sinks and stuff, I don't have to worry about them, um, running back and forth to fill these. Although it's not a huge issue right now either. My power use is pretty high though. And I can take this vent though and pump it upward more. Research. Oh, fine art. Let's do this one so that way I have an orange desalinator. And look at everybody made it up there to eat. Hmm, Lindsay didn't. Very low stress, though. Do they get the buff from this being a room yet? They don't. Yeah, it's really water. That is my concern that I don't want to try. I want to try not to ever run out of. And I can take this polluted water here and move that down. That would help. So what I need to do is extend this right to there thing is, with power use going up, I do need to do something for electricity. But if I keep just what I have on and none of this yet, maybe I could hook this pump up to here. Once this runs out of water, I'm gonna have a problem. So I need to have a way to fill this back up with water. And that will come from somewhere. I am doing okay on food, though. I am I'm happy about the food. Where is this polluted oxygen coming from? Your research. So, why? Well, I don't have that yet. Let's do plastic for now. Animal control. Alright, can I plant my bristleberry briar seed? I can plant. What can I plant up there? Oh, these are just decorative seeds. Zombie spores? Oh, that's terrifying. I don't even know what that is, but that does not sound good in any sense. I do think I'm going to make this the hatch room. So I need to make a way for air to get in there. Actually, it should be alright. This down like so. Well, let's, let's extend this out. No, let's do this. That, let's do the printable. Hmm, that's bad. Let's 
good, but we don't need a decorator yet. Shovels or briar seeds? Let's do more briar seeds. Why not? Okay, we're gonna put the door in. We're going to put in critter drop off. Uh, there. Critter feeder. There. Carbon dioxide doesn't seem to be doing too terribly bad. I want to build a refrigerator as well, but again, I'm not too keen on randomly spending the make it into a great hall. S hall. Room size 40. What's I want I wanna know how much Ralph plus three. They skewed pheromones, huh? Oh yeah, I'll put one in there then. We can put one here and in the bedroom. Okie dokie. That should make things look a little nicer for now. Okay. Problem number one. They're gonna run out of water. So for now, priority six disc. And that will pump all that water down in here, which will get that running again. Then I'll close this off, build a ladder up, and tap those two too. And sorry little fishes, but you're coming down. I don't know what you're good for anyway. Feel bad that they gotta run across with that stuff. Briar seed. Briar seed. Okay, this is going to be for... Hatches. This is going to be for... Hatches. We're going to wrangle. Wrangle. Who else? You. Wrangle. I don't know if I'm just lucky with finding those guys or if they're like naturally there and that's supposed to be your first source of renewable like you know what I mean. Alright I'm gonna switch this up to his priority seven then because apparently everybody's busy. Colony lacks critter ranching one. Alright do I have someone that can take a skill? Digging, proven, farming. Ugh, nobody here. Actually. Alright, so getting a rancher would be our ideal. So cancel this. Yeah. Honestly, the amount of polluted oxygen coming off these freaking algae things. You know, can I deconstruct some of these? No, I already have negative oxygen. Alright, we're going to. Let's do HVAC. I think I need to have somebody whose priority, main priority, is digging. And that would be Lindsay, but her priority right now is building. So if I put up... I need a digging rancher. That's what I need. I don't understand why they... I, uh, is, is sweeping this stuff up usually something I have to tell them to do? Oh, okay, those accidentally got put up to a high, high priority. Who's starving? You can go eat, you know. We have lots of food. Alright, let's just put this back down. I goofed up. Let's put this at a priority five again. What's your priority, Lindsay? Or Nisbet? Whoever was starving? You. Going to eat. That. Oh, they dug up here when I wasn't looking. Okay, that makes sense. How do I make this like a priority nine sweep? Better yet, what if I just deconstruct that? Build another one down here. But these are actually consuming a small amount of carbon dioxide, which is pretty important. Okay, why are you starving? I do not understand. Nobody's eaten today yet. What is yucky lungs? Production. Okay, so they're just gonna consume a little more air, which will probably mess up my air thing. Maybe I should build a refrigerator. Alright, this is their downtime. Everybody's going up. Yeah, everybody had time to eat. Digging. You can be my priority digger. Or suit wearing. Bungle spores. Suit wearing is important though, too. Like, who do I have? Where's my skills? There's probably a hotkey for that. Alright. Anybody have digging? You got digging. 
I need one more person with digging. But am I willing to bring on an eight, another person? Should I? Because everything is getting done, to be fair. Suit wearing is probably important end game. Can't sleep in complete darkness. Oh, there's always a freaking light bulb in there. Too bright. Hmm. I'm gonna stay at seven. I just... I'm gonna stay at seven. I'm gonna take the fungal spore. Which we'll plant somewhere later. Pretty sure fungal spores. Let's see my little book. Ooh, plants. Dust caps, is that what it is? Must be, it looks like the only mushroom here. Yeah, dark areas! Darkness. Carbon dioxide. And they take slot. So I need a dark spot full of carbon dioxide. So at the bottom of the base. Eventually. Not now. Oh, okay, that's hooked up. So now I can deconstruct this. I don't know if this will fit with the molding up there. But this will save them time, because they won't have to run to the outhouse anymore. Okay, and then I'm going to do... Liquid in will be clean water. Which, technically, that drops in here. So, I mean, why can't I just siphon it off of that? There. Outward. We need a vent. Alright, let's choose a research. Medical equipment. Okay. Oh, a gas reservoir. I don't even remember having that. Alright, where shit where was what was I doing? Fight. Outward. We'll run that through the roof. So outward. There we go. And then all of this pollute this will give me more water back instead of dirt. Which would actually help me. I mean it's gonna have a little food poisoning in it. That's okay. Make sure I didn't just break it. Actually, can we just disable? Let's just deconstruct this one here. And that one. Am I okay just piping into that? No, because if that that's what it was. If the the if I run out of polluted water. There we go. And then I can build a sink too. Which same thing, five kilograms in and out. Deconstruct that. So you guys are gonna have a little less bath time for a very short amount of time now. Where's sink? All of this movement stuff is going to heat the base up a little bit. So, what I should do is I should get over to the ice place and get some wheeze warts so I can start cooling it down as soon as possible. But to do that, they need to finish this. Let's do... Because what I was thinking is that I'll dig upward for that and build an airlock here going this way. Or maybe what I should do is go out right here in between the slime plots. Ooh, what's that? Tropical fry egg. Because the heat is coming. It's going to heat up in here because I have people running around and doing things and machines running. Because these cause some sort of heat, don't they? I just kind of feel that that's a bad spot to go through that. Well, I could just go straight this way. That's the hot spot. Because I have to go to the, I want to go to the natural gas vent eventually anyway. Why are you starving? Does she just get so busy? So what I would do just head straight that way. What is that? I just polluted oxygen. Okay, so I'll just keep going straight this way. Like so. And I'll extend this. This will be a buffer anyway. And then I 
I can take out all this. And I'll put in... Where's my oxygen checkpoints? Okay, going that way, you're gonna go in here, through the airlock, grab an oxygen mask, and then go forward more. And then I'll put the dock here. And then I'm going to put on another one of these. Here, and then here. And let's cancel this. Let's leave that an unreachable build until they get this done in the lavatories. Because I want to see if this works. Because if that works, and I get that polluted water down there, because this is working. It is moving polluted water. And this produces polluted water. So, if that produces it, polluted water, it's 11 kilograms per use. And it only requires 5 kilograms per use. Interesting. It's going to heat things up a little bit, but wait a second. If it, can, if it takes 5 kilograms of water and gives you 11, technically I will never run out of water just with the, the toilets. I mean, they'll be drinking... Uh, recycled toilet water, but like it's not that bad a little bit of food germs And if I had to I could put a tepid 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 thing in here and heat the water up to kill all the germs Oh, is that hooked up and running? It is actually well done guys That's actually pretty cool All right, so here let's Deconstruct all of those and deconstruct these two wash basins and I will give them lavatories. Edison, I'm going to give them all sinks. And then plumbing wise, we can hook this all up. And And then we will be fully civilized. That's cool. I mean, it is creating some food poisoning. But, like, this is being sieved out as fast as the food poisoning is literally dying in the polluted water. I'm gonna put this back down at two for a little while because I'm a little uncomfortable running that at that speed. Okay. Doctor, no. Pufflet, no. So you can't wrangle the Pufflet, so he'll just run around giving out slime. That'll be a big problem. Um, an arbor acorn, I guess. A tree sounds nice. Can I plant a tree somewhere? I don't know. I don't know how. In a farm plot, maybe? It might be a decorative thing, too. Oh, that looks pretty cool. Harvested. Oh my gosh, that's where you get lumber! Oh, okay. Tree branches can be towers over lumber. That would get me a wood burner. Temperature 59, air, dirt, polluted water. Okay, so where should I put them? Up here, maybe? So, by the way, that should probably be those. I wonder. I could make this farming over here, too. But I don't, I want to wait on that a little bit because if I. Oh, here, let me. I'll just put in one farm plot and that tree. Should I put the farm plot down here? Probably should put it down here because that's where the. That's five, that's three. This should have all been up there one. But it's a little late now. We'll put this here. Oh, wait. This says polluted water. So there's a chance they could spill it. So I'll put it there. Unless I can plant it in here. Fryer seed. Can I put another one of those somewhere? Decor is looking pretty good, too. Oh, they like it up there. That's because of those little lightning bugs. Oh, all the toilets are done. Make this left. Probably build showers, too. Improves morale and reduces surface germs. Looted water, thousand. In a thousand, out a thousand. Well, that's not too bad. And these can't create that much heat. Hopefully I'm not wrong in that assumption. Okay, there we go. We have flush toilets and fancy pantsy sinks. And I think that's where I'm going to call it quits with this one. Um, thanks for watching. 
if you haven't subbed, please sub, and you can uh, catch what comes out next. Um, if you haven't liked the video, please like the video. I really do appreciate it. If you have already liked or have already subbed, or even if you're watching this, I really, really appreciate that. Thanks again for watching. Um, if you have any suggestions or other games you want to see me play, let me know down in the comments. And I'll see you in the next one.